She is known for her contributions to planetary geology and volcanology, specializing in comparing volcanic processes on Earth and Mars. She is recognized for her discoveries of previously undetected active volcanoes on Jupiter's moon Io. Her name is Rosalie Lopez. In the realm of planetary science, one name stands out, Rosalie Lopez, a Brazilian-born scientist whose contributions have shaped our understanding of volcanoes and celestial bodies. Born in Rio de Janeiro and inspired by NASA's Poppy Northcutt, Lopez ventured to London in 1975 to study astronomy at the University of London. Graduating with honors in 1978, she initially focused on astronomy but soon found her passion in volcanoes, both on Earth and in space. For her doctoral studies, Lopez delved into planetary geology and volcanology, completing her PhD in planetary science in 1986. Her thesis compared volcanic processes on Earth and Mars, leading her to travel extensively to active volcanoes and become a member of the UK's Volcanic Eruption Surveillance Team. It was during her first encounter with the fiery Mount Etna in Sicily in 1979 that her fascination with volcanoes truly ignited. Lopez embarked on her postdoctorate career as the curator of modern astronomy at the Old Royal Observatory in Greenwich, UK. In 1989, she conducted hazard mapping at the Vesuvius Observatory in Naples, Italy, further solidifying her expertise in volcanoes. Her journey then took her to the prestigious Jet Propulsion Laboratory in California, where she joined the Galileo spacecraft project. From 1996 to 2001, Lopez worked on the near-infrared mapping spectrometer team, analyzing observations of Jupiter's volcanic moon, Io. In a groundbreaking discovery, she identified 71 previously unknown active volcanoes on Io, expanding our knowledge of volcanic activity in the solar system. In her pursuit of scientific knowledge, Rosalie Lopez has not only made groundbreaking discoveries but has also dedicated herself to education and outreach. She firmly believes in the power of spreading knowledge and inspiring the next generation of scientists. Lopez has traveled around the world, giving public lectures in countries across Europe, Asia, and the Americas. Her passion for education led her to co-organize workshops for the United Nations and the Planetary Society in 1992 and 1993. Lopez's commitment to public education, particularly among Hispanic groups and young women, has not gone unnoticed. In 2005, she was honored with the prestigious Carl Sagan Medal by the Division for Planetary Sciences of the American Astronomical Society. This award recognized her outstanding efforts in public education and her dedication to nurturing and mentoring young scientists. Lopez has used various mediums to engage with the public, including giving talks, participating in interviews, and writing articles. She has even authored a book on planetary volcanism, sharing her expertise with enthusiasts and aspiring scientists alike. When Lopez is not immersed in the world of science and education, she indulges in her hobbies. She finds solace in exploring the underwater world through scuba diving. The thrill of diving into the depths of the ocean allows her to witness the wonders hidden beneath the surface. Additionally, Lopez enjoys hiking and takes pleasure in the beauty of nature. She has a particular fascination with volcanoes and finds joy in visiting them, witnessing their majestic eruptions and studying their geological formations. Her love for volcanoes extends to collecting volcano art, which serves as a constant reminder of her passion for the Earth's fiery forces. Rosalie Lopez's journey has been marked by remarkable scientific achievements, but her impact goes beyond her discoveries. Through her dedication to education and outreach, she has left an indelible mark on the scientific community and inspired countless individuals to pursue their own scientific dreams. Do you want to explore more scientists? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.